Okay guys, so welcome back to another episode of Skyblock and in today's video what I'll be doing is showing you how I got my first 100 million coins in Skyblock. So basically just giving you tips, showing you how I did it and what you should do to get a lot of money easily. Now if you're a late game player and you have a bunch of stuff then I think the best thing you can do is just build yourself uh, out of farm with totems. But let's say you don't have enough money for totems, let's say you don't have enough seeds to build this up of farms a thing you should definitely do is use a farm that i used before i build this auto totem farm and that farm requires auto hotkey clickers and auto clickers and yes this over here is basically the farm as you guys can see and i've reached 100 million many times also right now i have 103 million i've also just wasted a bunch of money i, I wasted like 40 million on onion totems because I, I don't know why, I just did, and then gave away most of it to fans. Okay, so I have 7.5 thousand gold for my last video when I did that 10 thousand gold, but yeah, the main thing, I didn't record for 3 days, but I was grinding, yeah, I was grinding. I have 2.5 million onions. Yeah, uh, 2.5 million onions, that's like 75, 80 million coins or something around that. Because if I had exactly 2.5 million onions, that would sell for 75 million, I think. And I don't know if you guys realize, but I also have 22,000 onion seeds. And yes, I of course don't need this much, so I'm giving away a lot of stuff in my Discord server. If you're not in my Discord server, make sure to join it. The link for it will be down in the description. And now just meanwhile, self-advertising, general group for some merch thank you very much and yes as i said just a little bit ago what you'll need for this auto farm is an auto clicker an auto hotkey clicker and macros and basically what you do is you use auto hotkey to spam f so you harvest crops you use auto clicker to replant them and you use macros to just automate all that process so first of all what you have to do is make a place like this like a little house we can call it like that it's not even a house it's just uh, some path start of some path and it has to be in your spawn point so let's say you go like this and jump down and okay i didn't die thank you very much also just want to mention real quick i died while i was holding my crystal those buffalo core cr crystals and i lost 60 of them and then I did some trade-ups and I have 27 now, so I think 27 should be enough and I'm, I'm done grinding those blue falcors. It's really annoying and I'm, I've had enough of it because they just keep flying and it's... Uh, I hate it so much. But okay, back to the topic of the video. So, you, as I said, you have to create like a little house like this, uh, path, start of the path. That's basically your spawn point. So, once you fall, you get right here and then you have to activate your auto hotkey clicker and auto clicker and just you just run like this and you don't even have to move just holding w and what that auto clicker and auto hotkey clicker will do harvest and replant in the same time so you're doing both in the same time so you don't have to go like twice or something like that. Now I don't have my auto hotkey clicker and auto clicker enabled at the moment, especially not my macros, which I won't even enable my macros, even though I could, but I'm gonna show you how to set it up. And where you can download all this stuff from is in my Discord server. You have it all in announcements, you just have to scroll all the way up, but I think I should make a like specific channel where I should post that stuff, auto clickers and everything, which I probably will do if i don't forget and also if i'm not replying to comments it's because of that wanna be friends thing because i, don't, I really don't want to get hacked or anything like that and i don't think youtube solved all of that problems so i still won't be replying to comments even though i wish i could but i can't and no matter what i just don't want to risk being exposed to my account being stolen or anything like that so i'm gonna play safely okay so now that i've explained you kind of how all this works let's get to the actual point and how you can enable enable all of this stuff and actually use it so let me go ahead and move my recording to my desktop okay so here we go we are at my desktop you guys like my background it's pretty cool yeah i know so what we have to do is first of all you need those auto clickers so let me just put those up here okay so there are three things you need first of all this most simple one is auto clicker and i'm using 2.1 version because you can open multiple of them which is better definitely better than 3.0 so you just click on it download it and you have it it's 
it's, it's pretty simple to use and i think everyone will understand it so this is how it basically looks like you have the time how fast you're gonna, gonna click and i of course always go for zero milliseconds double click and yeah that's fast as possible so that's about the auto clicker so we can move it aside now what we have here is auto hotkey clicker and this is this all three things are basically auto hotkey clicker so first of all you need to run this file which is basically an installer which will download i think this access to auto clicker files and this is like a file that's uh, a notepad it is actually a notepad but it's an auto hotkey notepad so like if i would right click on this and go open with and then go notepad you guys can see that this over here is a script and you basically create your own auto clicker auto hotkey clicker and i'm also gonna leave this script in my discord server so you can just copy paste it so right now it's made so it spams q so let's change it change that to f let's save and close it and i've downloaded this auto hotkey like two years ago so i'm not exactly 100 sure how it works but i think you have to have this green thingy so you can run this and how you can get these files is by running this so just if you would use everything that's listed over here and then just use the script and i think you should be able to use it perfectly like just fine and also as you guys can see in the script it says f4 over here so this f4 and this f5 is basically how you start or and end the auto clicker so if you wanna start clicking you press f4 if you wanna stop clicking you press f5 now of course you can change this for example to any key you want so let's put u over here and k over here so if i would save it like this then every time i would press u it would start clicking and every time i would press k it would stop cl clicking so i hope you guys understand what i'm talking about here but yeah since i don't want to keep it like that i'm gonna use f4 and f5 because i just wanted to say this because i know some laptops don't have f5 and f4 for those f keys so you might want to use some other so yes that's about the auto hotkey clicker so we can move those also aside and then we have tiny task which is a macro and you just run it by running it like you just download it you're gonna have it like this then you record a macro and everything you do with your keyboard or mouse is gonna save that process and every time you start a macro it's gonna just repeat it and that's basically what macro does it's really a powerful program to be honest and everything is legit over here i've talked with the moderators of the game and everything this is allowed so feel free to use it don't be scared or anything it's completely fine oh and also i i think i forgot to mention how do you actually finally run everything over here you just right click over here and then run script and then now if i would press f4 it would start clicking the button and now one of the more advanced things is vm which you, you don't need vm for this which is a virtual machine as i was talking before in my past videos i'm using this one over here so if you would run this it's basically like a pc or pc with a with an arm mouse so that mouse for example can keep clicking and you can have a whole macro running in your vm meaning while you're doing whatever you want on your main pc so okay so now that we are in the game let me just really quick go ahead and get my onion seeds okay here we go so you have to have these equipped so let's turn on auto hotkey clicker auto clicker and now i will just run like this and yes that's pretty much it as i'm going i'm harvesting i'm also replanting instantly and yes you can macro all of this so it constantly repeats this process so for example if you make this huge line at the end of the line you would just jump off the island and you would be back at the start and the macro would just keep repeating that constantly constantly over and over again so yes that's how you can create this auto farm it's not that hard like it's really not if you do everything as i said and if you have any questions don't ask me because i've explained this in the best possible way Th there can't be any possible way of explaining this okay so now that i'm at the end of the line so let's say i'm using the macro i would disable my auto
auto hotkey clicker and auto clicker walk over here jump off and be at a start and over here i will stop recording the macro and just let it run constantly and it will keep repeating the same process okay so let me get back to the normal screen okay so it should be perfect right now like way better resolution and you guys can see that getting these onions was pretty fast like i'm still getting these pop-up messages over here in the chat and then after you farm yourself a lot of onion seeds and a lot of money using this method you can of course go ahead and spend your money on iron totems or maybe some iron farms and so you can finally make yourself some of these automated farms with onion totems which i don't know if they're better i would say it's all the same if you have the vip if you don't have the vip then these totem farms are definitely better but if you do have the vip because of the double harvest chance these farms over here might be really powerful i mean maybe even better than these but i don't know i honestly don't know because like look at this look at how many onions it's, there's over here so if i would just turn on my auto clicker it's going pretty fast now they've despawned but if i would just wait a little bit you guys can see that i'm getting like three four every second and now when they all come in it's like 10 per second or maybe even more than that like if you're using these tower farms, we're gonna call it like that, these tower farms, as soon as you join the server, you, you, you just have to rush to your farm, start picking up stuff, because it's gonna glitch with the chest, and it's gonna glitch with the items on your island, and they're constantly gonna be stacked, and a lot of them is going to despawn, so it's really important so that you keep collecting them from the whole start. And also, I have a pretty cool video idea for tomorrow, so let me know what do you think about it, I'm gonna say it right now. So what I'm planning to do is, like, go to the shop and spend 25 million coins or 30 million coins, something around that, and spend it all on totems. And with those totems, go around people's islands and place them. So basically, it's like trolling, but at the same time giving people free items. So what I'm planning to do is like buy 300-400 stone totems or iron totems or onion totems and just use my other clicker, go to someone's island and just place them everywhere. It's kind of like destroying their island but then in the same time giving them items. So it's not really being rude, you know, I'm trying to also be nice but keep it interesting, you know. And also I'm not sure if I'm gonna make that video tomorrow or two days after this or three days after this but I'm definitely gonna make it if you guys want me to. But alright, whatever, just gonna end this video here, as I was saying, hope you all have enjoyed. I really hope all of this helped you, and you actually managed to create your own auto hotkey clicker farm. So yes, once again, hope you all have enjoyed, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video.